the United Nations Convention on the Rights of the Child, Article 38, is to the effect that persons below 18 years do not take a direct part in hostilities and that they are not compulsorily recruited into armed forces. With Joseph Kony, the law was debris. During the Lord's Resistance Army, LRA war, where Joseph Kony and his rebel group were fighting the Uganda People's Defense Forces, Joseph Kony kidnapped young boys and turned them into perfect killing machines. You and I have lived through many things, but our healing point has had a lot to do with somebody being your shoulder to cry on. Joseph Kony, the leader of the rebel group Lord's Resistance Army, took thousands of children from northern Uganda and turned them into killers and murderers. Today we are hearing the stories of former child soldiers. I'm in a place called Laminadeo in Gulu district, northern Uganda, at the Watoto Children's Home, where some of these children are rehabilitated. Next on the show, we're going to hear Michael's story. How are you, Michael? Fine. Mm. How is life? Going great. Mm. Yeah. Michael, when were you abducted by Joseph Kony? That was, that was in 2007. Mm. Yeah, I was just doing my school time. Mm. Moving to school, that's when they took me, mm. and with many many brothers of ours mm. and friends, we were taken together. And just I think by the, by the grace of the Lord, I came back with few other. Mm. How old were you when you were abducted? I was just seven. You were just seven years old. Yeah, seven. Yeah. Michael was abducted at the age of seven on his way home from school. He was taken to Connie's rebel camp where he underwent training together with other child abductees on how to attack, kill and destroy. At first Michael did not comprehend the atrocious magnitude of what he was involved in. All he knew was he was having fun at it. What happened when they took you? They took us, I had a training, because they even trained us like the soldier of Ghana, this mm. one. And then I had a training for just, I took a training just for one week, because I was like bright and I got things quick and I was even strong. They just took me, I had a training for one week and then they took me for war. What happened in the training that you were telling me about? Uh, during the training, uh, mm. that, that would be a hard time, because mm. they tried even to kill you. If you don't be strong and if you don't be brave, they will just kill you and they will leave you. So Michael, when they were training you to become soldiers, what did they tell you you were going to fight for? They told me that they want, the, they want our leader to lead even to Uganda. Mm. So they, they're teaching us so they may fight against the, you, the, these other soldiers. Because there are many groups of soldiers mm. differently. Mm. They're just not one. And there mm. are many Konyans, there are some group from Sudan. We have to fight. But we defeated them and we got another camp. We have to fight like that. We have to fight. And then at the end of the day, they just got out together. Put so you mean the war was not between Lord's Resistance Army Rebel Group and the UPDF? They were, it, yeah, both with the UPDF too. Mm. And the fighting, they were, the UPDF were defending people. Mm. So they want to get more soldiers, mm. more young people to fight against the other people too. Mm. Mm. When you were taken, and even in those pros, uh, you know, in the initial stages when you're being trained as a soldier, what was going through your mind? Did you ponder escape? I, during that time, I don't think of home even, because mm. I got that boy of, that boy is kind of, he's my cousin even, and we are too close to him, and he's, he has great things, because he's a leader, he mm. has great things, so we are too close, and I don't mind about home. I stayed there for one year, mm. and they told me that, I have to, uh, to tell me, yeah, my, that cousin of mine asked me if I'm missing my family. Mm. Then he told me that he want to go back home. And, and told him I will go with him. But he, what, he, didn't, know, he didn't know that I, what, I liked the place. Mm. He just wanted to escape and leave me there. So I, did, I was close to him. Mm. I get to know that when they were trying to kill me. Mm. My fellow friend mm. tried to kill me. Then mm. we were 
He told me that you will leave me. So I knew that if you, if you leave me, I will be killed. Mm. Not until a friend of Michael was brutally murdered in his presence that it suddenly dawned on him that he was involved in something evil. When did you start killing people? During that process that they want to kill me, that mm. boy want to kill me, that's mm. when I started to fight, fighting what, to defend myself. Mm. And I had to fight, and I didn't, now I wasn't close to my real, real cousin. Mm. I'm just now protecting myself. Mm. I never know about, I, I don't even care about anyone. Mm. Just care about myself only. Mm. Did you ever go to war, like, between the yeah. rebels and another group? I did, I, I did. Tell me about that. We just, we, we, with UPJ, we, mm. fought, we fought again, I was like twice, I did us twice only, just myself. Mm. You just, they caught us moving to another, different places, to mm. different places. So they, they surrounded us, Who? the, the UPJ. Mm. So we have to fight to mm. protect ourselves. Mm. But I wasn't, the gun was so heavy for me to carry. Mm. That, during this process, that's when we started what, killing the, the UPJ and even other people among us. Mm. And the, this. Fellow people of ours, they were forced, forced us to what? kill people. How many times did you uh, did you get involved in in fighting? Was that the only time you? Just twice, only mm. twice. And only the twice. third, the, the third one, I just escaped from there. Mm. And when that was when they came to our camp, mm. the place we were we were sleeping during the night, they attacked us, and then that was my chance to run. Mm. That the night when the UPDF attacked the camp. Yeah. Mm. Mm. Why did you run? Because if I don't, they will get me, or they will kill me, mm. or just they will leave me, so I will not have no, no place to go. Mm. They will just leave me. So the only way to go, to escape, is to go with other people who are, who are escaping. Mm. So the time you decided to escape, what were the conditions? That was when there were a lot of war. Now, those guys are close to us. They're close to us, so. And they, it was night. Then we just, we ran, we ran. And I found that boy in the bush. He was now escaping, and that was that was the real thing that took me out. And mm. he told me because I was coming back, and he told me that if I come back, they will kill me. So that that's, that my enemies found me, and then he gave me a gun to carry. And yet the, the, we were still still were surrounded. He gave me a gun, and it was too heavy. Of course, I know what I knew how to swim. And then they just fall with the gun into the water. I, was, I stayed under the water like, not, I just come for oxygen and then I go back and I left the gun inside. And mm. that's when he got the chance to hurt me. Mm. Mm. How long did you stay in captivity? A very, in my heart here. When did you escape? Uh, I'm very, 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 but no chance, ma. My the woman learned the way. Kira rea 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 so a I know air and away, very Babylon near to recover. Babylon near to recover, he went with my name and a pair and a tea room. Ten and a footy, so be a tech for me. No, be a big pair. Can we never know what to do? Jim in the name for the one, so be a tech border, not tech yet, make an aware, tall, kill the bar water, come apart from the country. Then picking it, be a chamber watch. You know, when you got home and you found all these situations, some people are dead and then the, the village is stigmatizing you. What was your plan? Uh, uh, so Michael, did you see Joseph Kony? Did you get to talk to him personally? 
So I take bar bar to a bit of a year to the ring work, come with you and carry. Can not of ank, the temper and some bit of carry, the tick galactic cruise, cruise get carry now. My heart ached as I watched and listened to Michael give this dreadful account. He was and is still only a child, but his conversations are those of a war veteran.